What's going on guys, Not Far From Gaming here, or Jacob, and we are back once again playing some more Clash Royale. And today guys, before we get started, I just want to say a quick thanks. We've been hitting like over 50 likes for the past 6 videos, which is absolutely incredible. But I have a really good 3.0 elixir deck that is it's really weird, honestly. It's the Balloon Battle Ram, and it's doing incredible for us. I'm going to go ahead and show you a replay, and this is going to be a longer video, so that I can explain the deck more into detail. But let's go ahead and hop into a replay real quick. Quick little side note, I went up against a, a Lava Hound Balloon deck and we actually 3 crowned them. If you guys want to, I'll just put it on screen right now to show you. But this is a really good uh, battle and this guy's personal best. I said wow because I have a friend that's in this clan actually and it's so weird that we matched up. But this guy, his highest is like 4600 I believe, don't quote me on that, but it's around there I think. And uh, so we're going to start out with the Battle Ram and I don't think it connects on this one, it gets close. Yeah, it very, very close. Gets taken out. I just really didn't have anything to drop. So we're going to go like that. Drop minions in the back. We're going to... I should have probably went skeletons right there to take that musketeer out. But it's whatever. What's done is done. Well played right there with the ice spirit and zap. But then again, we got uh, pretty well played right there. I think he hits us with the well played. Yeah. So now that musketeer is coming over there on the left side. We can just go ahead and fire spirit. And it doesn't even get one shot off, which is really good counter. 2 to 4, that's a positive 2 elixir trade, which is really good. So we're going to go Battle Ram Balloon right here, guys. This is incredible. Check this out. Ready? Balloon. So we're going to actually connect with the Battle Ram on this one. And the Balloon, unfortunately, he used the Ice Spirit, so it's not going to connect dropping the bomb, but the bomb that drops hit the tower, which is really good. And I was like, oh my gosh, what am I going to do here? We're going to go ahead and drop minions on that bowler to take care of that. We're going to go Electro Wizard, and it luckily stays alive with... um. A little bit of health left and we're gonna shred that giant right there with everything we got and uh, we're gonna go ahead and just let this go I think he fireballs right here yeah so I guess that was well played by him but now he has no elixir I'm going balloon he's saying good game already guys we're gonna go balloon I'm going fire spirits because I knew he had minions but if you would have played them they would have gotten taken out but he doesn't play them so we're gonna take that tower down with the balloon so he's gonna go ahead and try to get a pretty big push off on the left side with that giant bowler Trying to build up a push, and honestly, I shut it down really well. So we're going to go Battle Ram Balloon up top. And guys, I was so close to 3 crowning him on this. Battle Ram's going to connect. Fire Spirits are going to take out those. He's going to Fireball. If he didn't Fireball, I would have 3 crowned him without a doubt. But we're going to take that left push out really well for um, considering that we almost took a, got a 3 crown and maintain defending. So unfortunately, it's going to remain at 196 health on the tower. Which is a bummer because we could have filled our crown chest a little bit more. But on the bright side, we did take a W and we didn't lose. Uh, so good game to him. And if you're watching this, good game. But let's go ahead and I think we're going to hop into a live match. In five seconds, of course. Got to go through the whole video. Alright guys, so we are going up against a, someone in that clan. And uh, obviously I'm not going to try to pronounce that because I have no idea what any of that means. But let's go ahead and just... Let's see what he's got going here. So ideally, you just want to go like this and see what he's got. Battle Ram scares a lot of people. I just noticed that that Battle Ram has a, a little limb sticking out of it. That was, <laughs> I never knew that. But, oh, this is going to be tough to defend. Let's go Electro Wizard right here. All right, so we're going to go like this. We're going to go like this. And we're going to go like this. That should take care of everything. Oh, the skeleton comes clutch. And that should take it all out. There we go. So, um, pretty good right there defending. And we didn't get anything on the push, obviously. No ta no damage except for that knight swing right there. Let's go ahead and reset to see what we can do here. And I'm not really sure what we're going to do yet. Alright guys, so he just went golem. We got to go big on the left side because we are so done if we don't. Uh, we got to get some damage on the left, so that might have been a little overkill because we're definitely going to take that tower out without a doubt. The only question is, are we going to 3 crown? That's what we need to do. I've 3 crowned 2 people with this deck, almost 3. You guys saw the last match. Uh, so we're going to take this uh, push out fairly well, honestly, for what we had. Let's go minions right there. Hopefully he doesn't drop a poison or something. That wouldn't really, really be well played by him. Executioner, that's not bad. Um, so it might get one bowl off or one rock throw, whatever you guys want to call it. Let's go ahead and get that damage right there. Boom. Taking that out. And we're looking pretty good right now. He does have quite a bit of damage on both my towers, but it's not really scaring me. So he's probably going to poison. Let's go all the way up here. 
And okay, 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 that's not good, that's not good, that's not good. Let's go ahead and zap this, boom. Oh my gosh, get that one out of there. Oh my gosh, Knight, run quicker. Jeez, what are you doing? Oh my gosh, all right, so he probably thinks we're gonna go right there, but guys, we're gonna go all in. We're going for the three crown, we gotta do it. He's gonna lightning down to five. Oh my gosh, this could be it. Please, Battle Ram, yes, Battle Ram's gonna connect. I think this is gonna be a good game, guys. And looks like it is going to be a good game. Let's go ahead and give him a well played and a thumbs up. And let's go ahead and hop into another one. We are 4-0 right now with this deck. All right, so we're going up against Carlos, and he is crying already. Are you kidding me? Let's give him a thumbs up. Cheer him up a little bit. You guys already know. So let's go ahead and see what he's got here. Let's just, uh, let's go knight in the back to see what he's got. See if he drops anything. Kind of get an idea of what he's got. So I could have just won a lecture wizard right there because I'm going to have to place it anyway. Hopefully he doesn't freeze. That wouldn't be very swell, would it? And the bomb's not going to drop on my lecture wizard because of the new time that it takes. Uh, let's go skeletons. Will that take care of it? Um, takes care of it a little bit. Not much. Knight is not going to get a swing off. Let's go zap right there just to get rid of that. I probably could have saved that or zapped a little bit earlier to maybe let the knight hit the tower. But... What's done is done, so let's go like this, like this. Oh, please go straight for the tower, ignore it, please. Oh my gosh, it did, and the Battle Ram's gonna connect, Fire Spirits are gonna connect, he's gonna Lightning, he missed my Barbarians, which is weird, and we're gonna take all that out right there. He said good game, is that like a, a BM good game, or he just thinks he's gonna lose? I'm not sure, but he's got the Lightning, which is kind of scary, because he's probably got a Lava Hound Balloon deck. I'm just waiting for that Lava Hound. Where's it at? Come on, you already I already know it's there. You got all the signs for it. There it is. All right, let's go like this. We got to beat him to the three crown. That's what you do. That's what you do with this deck, guys. You beat him to the three crown. Let's zap that. Boom. Um, come on, hit the tower. Not going to hit the tower, unfortunately. Let's go like this. We'll try to defend this. He's got the lightning, though. Is he going to use it right now? If he does, that would not be good for us. All right, gonna go Mega Minion, we'll go like that. And we'll go Minions right here since it's distracted. He's probably gonna Lightning at the last possible second. Looks like he's not. So we got a pretty good advantage right here on that right side tower and we defended that really well, honestly. 60 seconds left, double elixir time. Let's see what we can get going for us. Let's go like this. Like this. Like this, cause he's gonna drop that tombstone. We'll zap that, boom. Oh yes, Balloon's gonna hit the tower, that tower is done, oh my gosh, yes. Alright, so he's definitely gonna Lightning now. Let's go like that, Knight in the front to distract the Mega Minion if he drops it. He's gonna Arrow, so let's go Electro Wizard. Oh boy, okay, so we almost took that King Tower out, wow, I did not think that was gonna happen. Uh, let's zap all this. And we'll go like this. And we'll go like this, that Mega Minion can just get its few hits off, that's alright. Not too much damage there. Let's go, um, you know what, I think we're going to try to defend this. 11 seconds, he does have the balloon, so we got to be careful with that. Oh boy. Alright, here it all comes. Oh my gosh, he's not going to have enough time to get to the tower with my Electro Wizard, of course. Boom, there we go, good game. That is two Lava Hound Balloon decks that we have just completely destroyed, shut down. You just got to put pressure on the other side to take care of it, but that is 5-0 now with this deck. If you guys are wondering, we are going up against pretty good people. Let's see their trophy ranges. All right, so that guy's 3,800. This guy is a little bit lower. That's probably why I three-crowned him, um, but that's all right. 4,500. You guys get the point, though. We're going to hop into one more, guys. That's going to be three live matches now. If we keep winning, we just got to keep playing. You know, we're on a roll right now. We might as well keep going, uh, but let's go ahead and see what he's got going here. I just want to explain this deck uh, more thoroughly and let you guys understand how it works. So he's going to go Lumberjack. Oh boy, what's he got? Miner or Hog Rider? Or nothing. I'll take nothing, that's fine. Let, we're gonna go Balloon right off the bat though. Okay, yeah, he just pumped up. Definitely a great time to go Balloon. Battle Ram on him, boom, there we go. I would have liked to push with the Fire Spirits too. That's why, mostly, but we can go ahead and zap most of that out of there. Spirit Goblins are gonna be left, and that tower is gonna get hit by the Balloon and the Barbarians, boom. Well played, let's give him a thanks. That tower should go down. Yes, it is going to go down as a matter of fact. Let's go like this to distract all that. And we'll go Electro Wizard over here. This might be a little bit of trouble. We'll go like this. 
to distract that Mega Minion. And we're going to defend that really well. Oh, if it didn't get raged up, he wouldn't have touched the tower. But one hit on the tower is not bad. I'm really curious to see what this guy's deck is. I haven't really seen anything like this. Not very many people use the Lumberjack. But let's go ahead and he's going to pump up again, which is not good. Can we sneak a Fire Spirit or two over there to do some damage? It looks like we're going to sneak two over there. So he's got a Golem deck, which is... Um, Unique, of course. Everyone's running Golem. Let's go minions behind. He's going to drop the Goblin Gang or the Dragon. I didn't even think about that. Um, we are going to get a hit off. Not two hits off, though. And I'm a little scared right now, guys. We got a lot of stuff coming this way. Let's try to walk, walk that Mega Minion this way. Um, looks like it's not going to happen. We can zap all this, though. And we can go Skeletons right here in the front. Oh, boy. It's going down. That tower is done, guys. Oh my gosh, we cannot do anything about it. That's our first tower that we've lost with this deck um, entirely out of every single match, which is not good. Well, I guess it's good, but it's not good that we're losing uh, the towers. But let's go Battle Ram, Balloon, Fire Spirits. Let's see if we can get to that tower. He's going to go straight out for the three crown, guys. Really risky there. We're going to connect with the Battle Ram, and hopefully that Balloon can get a drop off. Come on. Drop it, yes, and that tower is going to go down, guys. 36 seconds left. Let's go like this. Come over here, Josh. And uh, we'll go like that and like this. 30 seconds left, guys. All we have to do is defend, but that is the hardest part, especially when they got two golems now, not just one. Oh, my gosh. All right, come on. All, all you guys come up here. Okay, one of them's not going to. 17 seconds. I have no idea what to do. We're getting notifications. Oh, my gosh. Are we going to get three crowned? Oh, my gosh. Are we going to get three crowned? We just took our first L with this deck, and I'm very sad because we had four seconds left until we would have taken that out. Oh my gosh. We got to hop into one more, though, because we can't end the video on an L. That's not good. We're going up against Sir Heho. He's giving us a thumbs up. Good luck. I, did I hit him with the good luck twice? I don't know. Extra luck for him, I guess. He's going to say thanks um, for the good luck, of course. Let's see what he's got. He's going to split his archers. Um... I think I'm going to be a little bit more patient this battle. I'm going to go minions in the back. I don't really have the ideal starting hand, but the ideal starting hand is kind of just rushing it. Oh boy, what's he got? I don't have anything for this. We'll go like that to take that out a little bit, I guess. Did he just zap my arch or the minions over there? We'll go like this. And he's going to say well played, but I'm pretty sure that was a BM well played. Not, not really well played, unless that's well played for him, but that was not well played for me. Oh man, Battle Ram is going to... Maybe hit the tower. It is going to hit the tower, and I'm not sure why he tornadoed that. He just made it go a lot faster, but we are starting this off really well, and I would hit him with the well play just to BM him back, but of course, he said, wow, that's why I didn't do it. I mean, he, he can hear me right now, so um, obviously I was joking, guys. I'm not going to BM him, but we can go like this and like this and like this, and all that is going to go down the drain. Oh, just kidding. One of them is going to jump. That's good. He might get one hit off right here. Uh, just kidding. Okay. Let's try to go for the two crown. We don't want to be too greedy because whenever I get greedy, we lose. Okay. So we're going to go like that. And we're going to go balloon and battle ram. See what it's going to do. All right. So that's going to lock on. The battle ram is not going to get to the tower, but the balloon is. Oh, boy. Oh, dude, that balloon just kobe Oh, my gosh. He just jumped so far. Oh, we're going to hit the Musketeer, though. That's good. We'll go ahead and go like this. Is he going to go Hog Rider on the left? He's got to take that tower out. We're going to take that Musketeer out, and our Electro Wizard is going to get a little bit of damage on him. Let's go like this. Oh, boy. Man, stop tornadoing my stuff. Not cool, yo. Um, so we're going to get some damage off of that Electro Wizard. How is he alive right now? I have no idea. Uh, but let's go skeletons right here. So he's got to get that left tower out or he's going to lose. Not sure why he's not going for it. Okay, so that was really not well played by him at all. Because we can just go like that. Balloon. And this is going to be a good game. Most likely, guys. Uh, let's see what he's got here. He's going to go... Okay, so that was well played. He's going to go Ice Spirit, probably. Um, tornado. Wow, that was, that was actually really well played. Uh, so let's go minions right there. We'll go like this. We'll try to destroy this. I don't know if it's going to happen if it gets a hit off. Zap it. Okay, so it's not going to get a hit off, which is really good. And it's going to get down to 142, guys. 
This might be a good game. If not, we can always push for the left side tower. He's cycling so quick right now. Oh boy, I gotta start cycling. He's. I think he doesn't have enough to uh, throw the fireball off. We're gonna hit him with a good game. And that is a lot of matches for this video, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed. Hopefully I explained it really well. If you have any questions or you don't have one of the cards, let me know down below. And the Electro Wizard is kind of hard to replace, um, being as it is such an important card in the deck. So if you don't have that, so you can replace the Electro Wizard with either the Musketeer or the Valkyrie if you like those cards, of course, because everyone has different opinions. But if you are new, it would mean a lot if you did subscribe. And if you like the video, hit that thumbs up button. I don't ask for like goals, I just appreciate them. And if I'm doing something wrong, let me know in the comments section and I will try to fix it. But other than that, guys, I will see you in the next one. Peace.